Public Schools does have a warning for parents as that work on I-465 continues. Yeah, the district is concerned the 15-day closure may impact bus routes. News 8's Demi Johnson is live to tell us how you can prepare. Good morning, Demi. Good morning. IPS is not just worried the closure will impact your kids getting to school, but getting them home from school as well. Over the weekend, the district tweeted it would closely monitor the situation and make adjustments as needed. We've been telling you about this closure since last week, but here's a refresher. Beginning today, work starts on the east and northbound lanes from I-65 to I-70 for the next 15 days. The closure impacts the I-465 and I-74 junction on the city's southeast side. Old US-421 and the Shadeland Collector lanes will also be closed. The work is part of a statewide $150 million plan to fix winter damage and pavement conditions around the state. As always, NDOT encourages you to plan ahead and find alternate routes and be prepared for slowed and stopped traffic. You have a few options to get around it. We have all those posted on our website, wishtv.com. Now, once this project wraps up, we aren't done just yet. The other side of the interstate closes for 15 days beginning next month. Be sure you're checking IPS's social media pages as well as our website, wishtv.com, to update you on the bus situation. Reporting from the southeast side, Demi Johnson, Wish TV News 8. And Demi, we are seeing a new tweet from IPS.